I'm not going down. You've got the wrong gun. Ah. I surrender. I surrender. Don't hurt me. Oh, good, good. Now heal. And no begging. change of heart. Come on, pal, don't do this. Just, just let me turn myself in, please. No can do. I'm a dedicated servant of justice, my friend. Count yourself lucky I haven't trust you in duct tape and thrown you in the trunk. Although now I've said it out loud, I kind of like the idea. Please, they're saying I could get five years. Five years! Whoa, oh, well, hang on, remind me. What did you do again? You're giving off a sex criminal vibe. What? No! They're just trying to charge me with check fraud, money laundering, workers' compensation fraud. It's crazy. It was just a few payroll taxes, for Christ's sake. Okay, I'm listening now. You had me at money laundering. What's your play? It isn't really a play. You create a shell company, take out a minimal workers' comp insurance policy, then charge subcontractors a fee to use that company as a dummy paper trail for their undocumented workers. I'm just a middleman, really. Whoa, 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 whoa. I take it all back. You are officially the most boring criminal alive. Nah, no, jail's the place for you for sure, for the learning experience alone. Why are we stuck? like a common toad anyway. You actually wouldn't find a toad in quarry. It's too dry. Whoa! Are you getting smart with me, admin criminal? No, no, I'm sorry. I'm, ju I'm just really nervous. Question my questions again. I'll slit your throat and let you gurgle the answer. Am I making myself clear? And one of the mining contractors I work with said I could lie low there, okay? I've been sleeping in a bulldozer. You know, you're really not what I pictured. I've seen those bounty hunter shows on TV. I was expecting some washed up 80s pro wrestler type, but you're much, much scarier. Well, I was expecting someone much, much, much less of a pussy. I have to say, for my first bail jump, you're a bit of a disappointment. I was hoping serial killer, maybe international drug czar, but <laughs> I get the payroll bandit. Pathetic. What you got for me? Hey, you being driver? Boy, am I glad to see you. Look what you brought me. Your relentless sunny disposition, it always puts a pep in my step. I aim to please. Well, witty banter completed, I'll give you my thanks. And I'll send you another file for your inspection.
that. I said I wasn't. I'm the one trapped hiding up here day and night. I ain't had nothing but potato chips in over a week. It ain't my fault you blew up the... You expecting someone? Okay, be a good little fugitive and hold it right there. Bounty hunter! Oh, oh my God! God.
favorite. No, 
but that's another story for another day. Leave them here, and I'll send you a fresh sheet. Christmas has been a bad boy.
right, all right, stop. I'll come quietly. Oh, that's better. Now let's go before I change my mind on the whole dead or alive. I'd rather die fighting than surrender to the hypocritical laws of your oppressive regime. Uh, although you did, in fact, surrender. I took a stance, didn't I? Stared the bully in the face, then back down at the last minute. That's how activism works. Not that I'd expect a mindless drone with a nanny state like you to understand. Whatever. You know, I never realized hobos were so well armed. I'm not a hobo. I've made a conscious decision to reject the capitalist society. By living in a hobo camp? It's a lifestyle choice, you government stooge. And have you looked in the mirror recently? This discrimination disgusts me. I only just got out of jail civil protest outside the exchange in Liberty City. Such a sense of the power of group action until we all turn on each other. Hmm. What are they trying to send you down for now? I didn't pay much attention to your file. Of course you didn't. I assaulted a cop at an anti-globalization rally, beat him up with a fire extinguisher, and I'd do it again. Screw the police. Nothing but mindless stories of the totalitarian regime. You're preaching to the choir, Pops. What? You're worse than they are. A paid thug of a corrupt legal system rounding up agitators for the ruling autocracy? A puppet on a power trip. I just wonder who's got their hand on your ass. Whoa! Hold on there, socialist Santa. If you want... You want an anarchy off? I will take you down any day. I wreak indiscriminate mayhem on an hourly basis. And secondly, no one has a hand up my ass. Would you like to look? Nobody's more anti-establishment than me, old man. I hate authority, so watch talk. Oh, I'm sorry. Hired mensch of the dictatorship. Did Daddy not love you? Daddy left me at a shopping mall and never came back, so I burnt it to the ground. I've lost count of the number of people I've killed in just the last week, and I am very happy to add your name to the pile right now. So why don't you shut your mouth? Okay, we'll leave it there. Touch you some good person. Well, if it isn't my dear old buddy Trevor, and he's brought me this reprobate. Hello, Maud. You know, I kind of look upon you as the friend I never had, the son I never wanted, and the shrink I could never afford. You do? Kind of. The pursuit of criminal men for profit is back-breaking, soul-crushing work. Oh, I can only imagine. I'm retiring, Trevor. I want a peaceful life, away from all this insanity and degradation. I want a picket fence, and a husband, and a dog named Skip. I want the dream, Trevor, and I won't let anyone stand in my way. Good for you, Maud. I wish you well on that quest. I'll find it, Trevor. I'll find it all. I'm a passionate woman. Goodbye, my boy. Goodbye, Maud. Be well.